Greetings travellers. Although building a low orbit base can be great fun, sometimes you might get stuck in the situation where your base computer is built too high and will become invisible on reload. But it is possible to get rid of it. A quick shout out to Idjat, whose video really helped me solve this dilemma. So as you can see, although the base computer is gone, the icon is still visible. So what we're going to do is build a platform directly underneath the icon and replace the base computer with a wire glitched one. And we want to just take note of the base's name because this will become very useful later. So the very first step is to warp to the base and then jetpack up onto the ship and stand on it. And then position the build camera directly above the icon and build a floor panel as close to the center as possible. I found I had to overlay the new base computer very precisely over the location of the invisible one. So I'm building a series of platforms where I can slowly incrementally increase the height to get on top of the other one. And now we're going to create a new base computer using the wire glitch. So select the base computer from the build menu and then press the toggle wire button. And then we press the toggle wire and the build button at almost the same time, giving a tiny preference to the toggle wire button. And you can see from this message that the original base computer is still there, blocking the installation of this new one. So let's pick it up and place it directly underneath the original base computer icon. And if you're lucky, the base computer will change its name to the original base computer. I wasn't lucky, so I had to build a series of platforms and slowly raise the base computer until it did start showing the same name as the original. So we can see here, finally, the glitched base computer is showing the same name as my original base computer. So they're almost directly on top of each other. But of course, when I try to open it, it says there is already a pre-existing base. So I use the small timber panels to slowly increase the height of the base computer. And finally, it enabled me to access the build computer menu. But my adventure didn't end there, unfortunately. I tried to delete the base, but as you can see, it didn't delete the base. I tried deleting it a couple of times and it didn't work. So I decided to leave the base and warp back to it just to see what would be there when I returned. So when I got there, I was confronted by two base computers. So I deleted one and accessed the menu of the other and I was able to delete the base correctly. And a quick check of the teleportation terminal base menu showed that it was actually gone. I'm sure there might be other ways to delete these bases, but this has been my experience. So I hope it was useful. Thanks very much for watching and we'll see you later.